Number 16 states, a photomicrograph of onion root tip cells during mitosis is shown below. Which phase of mitosis is occurring in the cell indicated by the arrow? So the cell that we are looking at is this one right here. And these bits that we see inside of the cell that I'm highlighting in blue here, those are the chromosomes in the cell. So what we need to know is which part of mitosis, which phase of mitosis is going on right there. And we look at our answer choices. It says prophase, metaphase, anaphase, and telophase. These are the four main parts of mitosis. So let's look at each of those in turn. So mitosis, first of all, is the uh, duplicating of a cell. So it's taking one cell, copying the chromosomes inside of it, and then splitting that cell into two cells. And it's, there's a lot more to that process, but that's the basic idea. The first step is prophase. In prophase, the, uh, the DNA, uh, the chromosomes, are going to be condensing into um, the, the X-shaped chromosome shape that we're used to seeing in all the pictures of, of cell chromosomes. Uh, it is the nuclear membrane is dissolving. A lot of stuff is going on in the cell. It's preparing to divide. So prophase starts with that PR, and I always think prophase is preparing. It's getting ready. Metaphase is where those chromosomes are going to line up along the middle of the cell. And they're lining up so that they can be split into the two different sides of the cell so that then it will be able to divide into two separate cells. So when I see metaphase, I think meta sounds a lot like middle. Meta is middle phase, right? So those chromosomes line up in the middle of the cell. Anaphase is where the chromosomes split and half of those copied chromosomes go to one side and the other half go to the other. So remember that the chromosomes here were copied during prophase while it was preparing so that you had two copies of the exact same chromosomes. They all line up in the middle and then they split so that half of the copied chromosomes go to one side and half go to the other so that each one uh, each side of the cell now has an exact duplicate copy of those chromosomes. In telophase, we actually have the beginning of that split happening. You can see that the cell membrane is kind of making this indentation. It's getting ready to go ahead and split into two cells. And the nuclear membrane that holds the chromosomes is starting to form again. The final phase of cell division is called cytokinesis, and that is when the uh, cell membranes go ahead and finish that splitting process, so you end up with two different cells. In case you need to know for a different question, the phase in between divisions is called interphase. All right, it's inter, right? Inter means between. It's the phase in between cell divisions. So knowing what we know now, prophase where it prepares to divide, metaphase where they line up in the middle, anaphase where they're splitting to the two sides, and telophase where they start to divide, let's look back at our picture and see which phase this is in. So it doesn't look like it's preparing. We see these chromosomes that have been pulled apart. They're not in the middle, but I don't see any type of cytokinesis going on where it's starting to split. So this must be in anaphase. So H is our correct answer for number 16.